Hello, and welcome to this new Pro Radio tutorial. To customize the logo and the main menu, go to Appearance, Customize, Logo and Menu Bars, Logo and Menu. Once you are in the Customizer screen, you will have several options to edit this part of your website. The menu position it has two menu options. You can choose to have a sticky or scrolling menu, and a transparent or opaque menu. If you choose your menu to be sticky, it will stay at the top of the page when you scroll. You'll be able to set the height of the items when the menu is scrolled, using these controls. If you choose to have a transparent menu, you will have the bar overlaying the header of your website. You can change the color of the main menu background using this color picker. You can also use a logo to replace the default text of the menu. To upload a logo, choose Select Image, then upload the PNG to the image uploader. Once done, you'll be able to change the height of your logo. To apply some vertical padding, and to add some horizontal margin to the logo. You can also control the height of the font size for the menu, but, of course, you need to make sure that it fits on a smaller screen. If you want your menu to overlay the header of the website, enable the transparent menu. Once enabled, the text will automatically use negative colors. You'll be able now to set a different size, and to upload a custom picture for the logo, for the transparent version. Once you scroll, the opaque version will be used instead. It's possible to adjust the size of the menu once the page is scrolled. You can also adjust the vertical padding, until you are happy with the result. It's also possible to upload a custom icon for the mobile version. Most of the websites use a squared icon, to leave more space for the other buttons. Then, you can control the extra functionalities of the menu bar, by enabling or disabling the extra buttons. You can show and hide the play button, which is an extra trigger of the play button, and show or hide an extra volume control. You can also show and hide the search button. If enabled, the play button can also be customized with a special text. The secondary header bar and the special call to action button are controlled by another section of the customizer. See you in the next video. Thank you for watching.